parents and guardians, listen up. This one's for you. It's such a fun time of the year, you know, buying your little ones their favorite toys this Christmas. But health experts want everyone to be aware of any toys that could be a potential choking hazard. According to national health experts, choking is the fourth leading cause of unintentional death in children under five years old. It's one of my biggest worries. Nine on your sides, Adriana Hargrove spoke with the NCDHHS about what parents should know ahead of buying those Christmas toys. Well, here's a perspective. According to health experts I spoke with, the size of a child's trachea is approximately the size of this, a drinking straw. Not very big, and they say it's easy for toys to get lodged in their throats. Now, along with getting age-appropriate toys, Jerry Matson, a senior medical director for the Division of Child and Family Wellbeing, says another thing to keep in mind is to make sure small parts on the child's toys don't easily break off. But many toys like balls and other things are definitely not going to be for kids under three. And I think some quick some people even use like a little toilet paper roll. I'm not saying to say if it can't if it you know it shouldn't be able to fit in there. It has to be big enough. But that's kind of a rule of thumb. We don't want a toy to be lodged um, or swallowed in an airway. Now, Madsen says what can make it worse is if a child has a cold. She says with a cold, the child's throat can be more restricted and smaller in size than normal. Now, Madsen also adds to keep an eye out for those Christmas decorations. They can also be choking hazards for young children. Now, for other toy safety tips, we have that at WNCT.com. In the newsroom, Adriana Hargrove, 9 on your side.